this isn't scripted in any form of way, I'm just gonna go off of what my mind's telling me at this point. I'll probably be looking some other things up just as reference for myself during this, but overall this is bad. This is extremely, extremely bad. So, Kabanamani 456. Inspiration for seems like a lot of people who are now speaking out against him, myself included. This man has truly lost himself. He's lost. He thinks he knows what he's doing, but truthfully he's not. And it's, it hurts. It hurts to see what he's doing now. He's doxing people, he's... He, everything is honestly just bad here. So, back in his fallout, back in 2018, he was with a girl that ended up trying to shove him off, but... Kobe decided to threaten suicide if she wouldn't stay. You know, it's a story we're all familiar with right now. And after that, we thought he was done. Left us on Donkey Kong, Country Freeze, Part 3, and leave his channel dead in the water. It's still there. Tark, Hive, the memories that that brought all to us. Heck, even now, looking at his channel, it went from, what, 3 million? to 1.31 million subscribers. I don't... It... Almost 1 billion views, too. So... This is... It's quite something to see. It's really appalling. So, I'm pretty sure the most recent, or the, well, at least the biggest pillar that brought attention to this was Premi to Remy on Twitter. Uh, pretty cool dude. Should go follow him. But, he tweeted out that Kobanamani456 is back, and you thought 2020 was out of surprises. Well, here's our 12, here's our 12 months of the disaster for me. For me, it's going to be this, and hopefully nothing more. Who knows, maybe something will perk up on Christmas time this time, but this caps out the 12 disasters of 2020. Bon or personnel. Kabaner Personnel and Kabaner Personnel 2 is his most recent channels. The first one has every video it looks like. Yeah, the first one has every video, meanwhile the second channel only has two. Oh, he actually uploaded more. Well, either way, both these channels are being used by Kobe. And it's being used to dox people. Which, as we all know, is not good. It's not okay. The man's talking delusions like denting metal and killing people. It could be Sully. It could be... Hey, it could be Rikibi. He has contacts with all of them still. He's still contacting them. Or at least Katie, anyway. Truthfully, if this mental health goes unchecked, the game's over. It's another Etika situation. We, talk, we call it as it is. This will end up like Etika if we don't do something. Etika went out a hero, 
But I guess Kobe just stayed around long enough to become the villain. As much as it hurts to say that. It, what made him come back is the question. I mean... He... Unless he was doing this under all this time, then what I don't see a real reason for him to come back it's all over cat's Twitter I'll go ahead and link that in the description all of this is under cat's Twitter it's plastered all over it but, as far as I know, the mighty have fallen. We're going to have to move on from him. Alright, so it seems like the lonely Goomba has uh, gotten all of this together. So I'll go ahead and read his comment. The key things I got from this whole thing or and trying to understand his mindset. He thinks his friends and family were replaced with aliens slash clones to set him up. This is why they turned on him or treating him differently. Not joking, I believe it's in his first video. Yeah, because it's it's something like uh how his one main part is like how his mom like disowned him over money. Which sounds really crappy. But, in the past, we never heard much about his mom, but, who knows. It's, his first video is just full of rambling, so it's really hard to understand unless you want to really dig into this madman's mind. He's obsessed with the IRS spying on him, and a person called Tim, who I don't know who that is. He thinks the adult star Victoria Cakes is his wife, to the extent he thinks people are are turning her against him. He spends ridic ridiculous amount of time on OnlyFans. Oh, ridic uh, an insane amount of money on OnlyFans. He thinks Etika was murdered. He's obsessed with Whole Foods. Like, really, really obsessed. It's weird. I guess the man's gotta get ripped somehow. I generally think he's part of a global conspiracy. Every time a tweet fails to send or he loses signal, he thinks he's being blocked and censored deliberately. He's into quick Quanon stuff. Um, no one looked that up. No one looked that up. I mean, the list goes on. He's completely lost it to the extent that it's just a chilling case of, and laying low. Case of just of chilling and laying low. He needs professional help. On one of his Twitter accounts, he talks about making an example of people. And he also talks about suicide. So I think this will end badly. Again, it seems like he's going in the road of Etika just minus the god complex. So, it hurts. Both ends of the stick. It it really, really hurts to see. This doesn't need to be longer. Please. Report his channels. Unsubscribe. Go. Stop. Him. We need to stop him. No matter what. Alright. See you next time.